Hello, welcome back to the translation where today we're tackling Emra. Emra. It's gonna be great. There's no music for the first few months. I'm not gonna be long today. I'm feeling sick and my chest is hurting. So I am not in the mood to be spending a lot of time doing anything. Oh, man. Let's walk to the mall. It's warm outside. I came back wet as a mop. Great. Great. Just the, just the kind of exciting stories you want to hear on this channel. Ah, oh, why does my chest hurt so much? Ugh. It's not right, though. Anyway, I think the music kicks in after this point. Yep. How much do we have in Emra's story? Um, not too much. It looks like it's a really straight flyer, though. I like how she says this, and then, like, it's kind of interesting that some of these characters, you really can't put their dates anywhere else. Because, how to put it, you can't meet Emra, you can't meet Bright, uh, Zhang earlier, because then you'd have to cross over on the same day, which would distract. Um, and you can't do Emra earlier, because you haven't met her yet, and you can't do her later, because after this you were sent away, and that makes the situation very awkward. Edifying. Goddamn, there, there's a fucking word. What is this? Oh shit, it took everything. Yeah, this is wrong. Do you want to skip the ending? <laughs> Steal the look. Ah, how does the word meeting escape me? Yeah, there we go. Ah, oh, man, the room smells. Ain't that great. My hands are all gross. Oh, oh, they're all leathery, too. That happens sometimes. That's great. That raw, leathery feel. I'd be more okay with it if it didn't make me half slippery, half grip. Like, you're like, I can hold this, and then what? It slips out of your hand. Ah, <sighs> oh, my back. Yeah, like I said, I don't want to do this too long. Ugh. <laughs> I'm just the kind of person I don't see any sort of dating chain working with. A character just wouldn't allow it too well. The thing that gets me, though, is why didn't you meet up with her at Emma at any other moment? Like, shouldn't you have met up with her by now, considering her position in the situation and all? Negotiation. Uh, ah, oh, fuck. Like, my word isn't. My brain is not working as well. Yeah, that is a good question. Like, you don't really know exactly what her motivation is.
Oh, uh, which one was it? Oh, fuck. Oh, frick. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's with an apostrophe. Okay. Just making sure. It's also slightly insulting in a way. I like the idea that she's already made her mark. Like, she's already made her mark. Like, she's pretty much done. Like, it was all to get a mark on the world, and she has it now. She's like, I guess I'm done now. Ah, oh, heckles. I think it's shout to culture. Gunst and Kultiger, that's the word I settled for. With this fucking drum, it's really tribal for what she is. I think it's with them. See, actually, let's look it up. Yep. <sighs> it's such a thing to lose track of, that you're doing paperwork, but you're so disconnected from the situation, it's entirely likely they could just lose track of it. Also imagine it's a chair. Like, I can't imagine Earth Dragons liking desks and office chairs too much. It's not their build, you know? I like how there's a clear sense of, like, for the people within her, but it's also a lot of selfishness. It makes her very complicated as a person within the political system. Like, you can never quite know if she's gonna do something to protect herself, or something to gain something. You know, it makes- it's, ugh.
might change this a bit. It captures the original feeling of the uh, May, you know. That's gotta be like, that's gotta be terrible, isn't it? Like the president of like the United States or France, or like even just, even just Putin or, or whoever runs China, just looks you straight in the eye and says, you have to play the game. Like I, with all of my power, have to play the game. Cause that is how the game is played. Like Putin just looks you dead in the eye and says, I have to do this. I can't even get around this. Like I pretend I'm powerful, but there's a human engine behind me and I gotta give them as much dog bones as everyone else in the system. You know? Like, I have to please my generals. I have to please my PR people. Because if I backstab them, there's a good chance a crack's gonna appear. And a crack is all it takes. A crack is all it takes. Through a crack, bigger cracks can form. Or things can slip in. Or slip out. You know? One crack's enough. In the right circumstances, all you need is one flaw. You're not really much of an ambassador. You don't do much ambassador stuff. At least not that the game... The game should have put more emphasis on that. Like, you're doing stuff. Although I get the idea that neither of them are quite sure what to do with it. Like, even if a dragon ambassador was said, they'd be like, What do we do? I'd like, I don't know. <laughs> I guess you're here to look around or something? Oh no, no, this should be different. There we go. I like how MRI is a sort of grounding of like, there are people in systems and they have to abide by systems and they don't like the systems, but they have to. And their job isn't great, but they know they can do something and they can achieve something. Ah, so cynical, but so true and so hard. We're almost there. It's always been 50 minutes. That's alright. That's a good number. I feel you should have earned an evil point for saying no. You know? Because it saves that. It says something. Ah, my chest! Why am I having this all of a sudden? Like, I had chest pains. At, like, random-ass times. But usually not after exercise. I need to figure out what this is. Because it's it seems to just be random. And it doesn't, like, impede me. I feel fine afterwards. It just... keep track of this more. Like, it hasn't happened in a while. It's also a very odd one, too. Because it's, like, very much the front of my ribcage. What could it be? Oh, man, I hate one thing, and that's I can't sleep straight on my back with my legs straight, because then it's sometimes during the night they'll start to tense. But they can't bend, because they're straight, so naturally they pull together, and they start contracting, and my muscles just tear themselves apart. It's a great feeling, and it just makes me limp for the rest of the day. For that day, at least. I 
I guess that's very true since you're basically saving humanity from a slump. Yeah, not laatschap, but it sounds so negligent in a sense. Legaat. I guess she's true. It's not something. I mean, like, you have to love culture and arts to become the Minister of Culture and Arts, because you're not gonna do much cool shit. Unless you like arts and culture. And paperwork. I find it very interesting that she doesn't know this. Like, she, she has ideas, but doesn't fully know, and it just... Mm, gives her a sense of, you know... Yet she doesn't become the minister of, I don't know, work and safety or something. Anyway, that's that for now. I'm keeping it nice and simple today. My hands are feeling fine, so they can rest for today. I got a pizza and a DM stuff today. So I'm busy enough as it is. Goodbye!